are a fairly new gallery, particularly in, uh, in Newcastle, uh, having only opened our doors in December. Um, you know, we wanted to create a space that, that is all encompassing and welcoming so that everyone can feel inspired or welcome or comfortable or, you know, feel like they can come into the space and, you know, sit down and chat and look at the work and, Originally, we, we, we have had access to a very rare selection of um, photography from William John Kennedy that was uh, friends with Andy Warhol and Robert Indiana in the 1960s before they were famous. Um, as a fine art photographer in his own right, he, he documented their rise to success from when they were developing their skills and their, their very distinctive styles, recognising, you know, some of these significant pieces of artwork that he thought would become iconic pieces, and of course they did. So we had access to this collection of work that had only been previously seen in a private collection. Um, it's never been seen in galleries before, so we actually have a, a world exclusive, which 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 in turn inspired us to want to create an exhibition um, inspired by the pop art movement, which was a very liberating movement um, in, in the world of modern art that changed the world forever. So I think, I think for us, a lot of, a lot of the, the work that we have, I think you need to see it in person. Mm -hmm. You need to be within in the space to see it a lot of the pieces are quite big and i for me mm -hmm. i if i'm if i wanted to buy something i'd want to see it in person i'd mm -hmm. want to see the texture of the brush strokes i'd want to see how big it is on a wall and feel the impact of it kind of staring back at me or telling me whatever it's going to tell me to mm -hmm. inspire me and compel me to to think about it when I leave or to kind of buy it and take it away with me. When people come and visit here, it's really great that we, we're able to speak to them and engage with yeah. them and, and share little details about the work. I'm, I'm new to this, this gallery. Um, it looks like it's got some really interesting, interesting work up. I like the idea of a space that's quite open and open space and it's got lots of different kinds of as well. Um, and the, the sort of the bow pieces as well from the window were really striking, so it kind of brought me, brought me in just to have a, a general browse. But um, yeah, it's really, really interesting work, um, and I might have to just check. Like I say, like art is a very kind of emotive media, you know, a way of expressing yourself, and you know, it can be a colour, it can be a, an image, it can be a person or just something that triggers something that makes you feel better about yourself or makes you, you know, remind you or, uh, uh, you know, of a, of a time or a place when things were good. You know, so I think that the, the art can, can bring you joy in many different ways. And I think if you don't have art in your home, then you need to come to the aviary quickly <laughs> <laughs> and I can help you choose something that's going to make you very happy. <laughs> <laughs>